What is going on, my survivors? And welcome to another episode of Deep Into the Depths. Now, a lot has happened since the last time. I technically recorded an episode that um, was supposed to go up on Monday, but there was double, au double audio because my, my, my webcam was also recording audio for some strange reason. It never does that. So I had to scrap the entire video. But pretty much what happened in that video is what you see me doing here, which is rearranging my inventory. I made a little bit more of a better storage area. Um, and yeah, um, I moved my farm, so I'll show that a bit, little bit later. But today is the day of um, showing off builds. Um, and today I'm showing off a particular build laid by Blue Jay here on the server. So if you guys are looking forward to that, guys... Don't forget to hit that big like button down below. Also, guys, if you guys want to become a part of my Zavala family today, you got to hit that big red subscribe button, guys. Also, guys, on the very next to my subscribe button, if you guys want to get notified whenever I go live or I upload a video, you got to hit that little bell to get notified. And without further ado, let's get this video started. I have to travel all the way to Blue Jay's house just to uh, get there. So, let's go. And we now have arrived here at our location, our destination, and stuff like that. The uh, build is in the background, made by Blue Jay herself, with a little bit of help here and there. Mostly people mining for her to get the stuff. But other than that, everything that you're about to see is made, designed, and built by Blue Jay. So, I hope you guys are ready for this, and I'm gonna reveal it after I eat some chicken. In three, two, one. It is a mother effing Pokeball. Now, Blue Jay, you said this was a very specific uh, Pokeball why don't you go ahead and reveal yes. which 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 Pokeball this is? It's the Moon Ball. The Moon Ball. In that, why did you decide to do the Moon Ball instead of like the which one is it? Like the the, the, the Water Ball or the whatever it's called, ball. the Dive Ball and stuff like that because of the Aquatic Update. <laughs> well, see, I had already started building a white base, and then I realized that the Dive Ball is completely blue. So I decided uh, to change it. It's now a moon ball. Ah, I like it though. <laughs> now, you're going to give us the official tour and everything like that, so after you. Sure. Oh yeah, this is Charlie. Charlie, my pet polar bear, who just randomly sat in my boat and has never left. Okay, hello Charlie. Even, even, even though buddy. there's... Buddy who? And his buddy Paul. Paul. Okay then. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so this is the first so this room. Is the, uh, this is the arena prep area. This is the only way to get in or out of the Pokeball. And it's, I did it on purpose. It's through the arena. <laughs> yes. Okay. Why is so that? So that's where you can leave all of your enchanted armor. Sean. Wait, wait, what? And then leave all your enchanted armor. What? And Why? Then... You don't have to leave it now. But this is so uh, it would be fair. Oh. Literally a test of skill. Because I haven't uh, built any leather armor yet. Oh, okay. But you go up these, you go up through here. And then you find chests. And these chests are going to have the armor and weapons available to you. Okay. Once I do that. And then this Whoa. is Whoa. Look at this. It is an ice arena. This is dope. Because you're in the ice it's biome, it, it makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. That's pretty That's cool. Yeah, it would not melt. And this That's is a resident cool. bat. So it's this Zubat. The so resident bat. Yeah. Yeah, it's a Zubat. <laughs> they named it Batman. Bat <laughs> hey, you, you can name Zubat whatever the hell you want. Okay, and then this is the Pokemon Town. Whoa. Ooh, wow. Yeah. So these are two resident houses over here. Um... They're empty on the inside only because I assumed or hoped somebody would make use of them. Each of them has something unique. So this one, although the both two stories, this one has a balcony. Um, and the other one, if you come take a look over 
here. And the other one over here has a basement. So you have the staircase that goes up. Oh, awesome! Oh, awesome. Oh, I I just might I just might move in move in over here because I didn't know I had a basement. Yeah, this one has a basement. The other one has a balcony. So they're both nice. This one's a little bit bigger because it doesn't have the basement. But um, I like them both. I think I did a good Hello? job. Hello. There's a map here. Oh yeah, I have to get the connecting map piece. So they don't match up yet, but eventually they will. Eventually. Um, all the green dots are points of interest because they are all places that people live. There's so my house, the, right the Pokeball. Yeah. And then that's uh, Christian or Sticky's house down at the bottom. And, and the, over here to the side is somebody else. I don't know who. <laughs> is this Tim's? I'm thinking it's Tim. Yeah, that's right. I think it's Tim's. Tim's. All right, um, cool. And yeah. I like the little, like, waterfall thing from the top. That is actually, I wasn't sure if I was going to build it yet, um, but that's going to be a landing access for when we have the Electras. So you can Ooh. ride the waterfall up and then fly some, to the top uh, of the Pokeball. Some, some, some future updates. Yeah, when we, when we get there, but I built it now. Just so so know what what's, it uh, like it what's, what's this shop right here? Uh, One. This is the Poke Center. Oh. Let's talk about uh, this, this one. building over here is the the building over here is the notice board center. So whenever you have quests for people, you can come up here and write in these uh, book and quills and put the quest up here. Oh, All of them are up for grabs. So whoever wants to take them, they're not named by person. That's so cool. I feel like that would be a little unfair. That's actually a really smart idea. So it's something, it's something, that, something, it's something, it's something we could have used. That's pretty cool. Wait, 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 so this is like your own personal shop too because like buildings is kind of like your thing. I didn't want to put my name on it because I wanted everybody to have an equal chance to accept the, the quest or the uh, request from somebody. Materials. Because if I made them by name, if I made them by name, we all know that me and Tim would probably get the most requests for things. So if it's something you feel like you can build, then by all means take it. Okay, cool. I like that. And then I put smart. the sign up. Uh, all, all posts are up for grabs. Payments should be posted at the bottom of your request. If not, you can negotiate. I all really right, cool. don't care. It's up to the. It's up to whoever's taking it and whoever is posting it. So what? What material? So did right you, what material do you use for this? It's red. Um, is that wool? Warp blocks. Oh. No, the black is wool. The red is nether warp blocks. Okay. Pokeball. Because it was, it was cheaper than redstone. <laughs> okay, cool. So this right here is the healing station. It requires two gold nuggets as payment. Okay, one second. Right. Y'all come over here. And Nurse Joy. Only. Nurse Joy, my Pokemon need healing. We got Pokemon. They died. It turned to Ghastly. Oh, God. <laughs> I actually have a Ghastly as my friend in Pokemon Go. So, do you trust me? Sure. Okay. Here's some gold nuggets. Ow. Now stand in the healing station. Okay. And drop the gold nuggets. In. Oh, that was cool. Oh, it's even doper. There you go. I'm all healed. You just drop the gold nuggets, and it it gives you splash potions of healing. That's, now, the that's... reason why I'm charging for this is because I need gold nuggets, or well, technically glister melons, to make the potions, and I don't have an infinite amount of gold. So yeah, that gold makes... nuggets, yeah. I, I can make the glister melon. Healing. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> and then the upstairs and then is up here. Ah. It's nothing fancy. It's just a bunch of beds and some chests, which I plan on putting some food in. So if people need a place to stay, oh shit, you can have this. <laughs> well, my spawn points okay. here. <laughs> okay, 
so there you go. It's just forever new the place to sleep. Yep. All right, what else we got? Over here. I left this one empty because you said you wanted to take advantage of a Pokemart. So, welcome to your Pokemart. Oh, for my pawn shop. Mm hmm That's smart. Anything that people need and shit. Yeah, oh, this is a sw Hello. I have Fire Coral Fan. Oh, yeah. I accidentally picked that up uh, with my uh, self-touch uh, pickaxe, but you can keep it if you want it. <laughs> and uh, upstairs, the only thing I did up here was put some item frames for you. Uh, other than that, I left it pretty much empty. You can fill it up however you want. Nice, so I have a shop here at the freaking Pokeball. Mm -hmm. So I guess it would be smart to kind of move over here already. And I've done so much in my house too. Uh, it's up to you, you can stay at your house, it's fine. It's just a lot it's just a travel though to get to my house to here. Mm -hmm. And then so I built this pond or this little uh, I like this little lake. I'm gonna fill it up with some stuff. I don't know if I could put um, like corals or anything on top of these wool blocks, but I'm definitely going to try. What's with the uh, little glass thing right here, though? That's what I'm curious about. This is this, technically a skylight. Um, the glass filters in from the top all the way to the arena. So I use sunlight to um, basically light the arena at the bottom. Mm. Also, um, idea for lighting besides torches, because it's, it's, oh, yeah, yeah, let's put it this way, yeah, torches, I just put look, down torches everywhere, torches look horrible, but, um, <laughs> I know in the towns, they have, like, the lanterns and stuff like that, like, the whole, like, light system that we had, we should do that. I can, um, what I was thinking is making more lanterns like these. Yes. That way they yes. The house. Yes. I can actually donate some of the uh, some of the materials for this lamp because I have a lot of I the. Used uh, the sea I think it was prismarine. Yeah. yeah, prismarine so, shards and. I need, yeah. I need to look it up. Yeah. So, so guys, so I have a question for everyone in my comment section. This is this is technically mine. Because of my pawn shop idea. Do, should I move in to this house? It's a little bit smaller than mine, but to put it simple, it looks a lot better. The what's redstone what's it over took here? To make the... The redstone it took to make the pokey sound. Whoa, it took... Whoa, whoa. Did you this just... Is, honestly, this is the reason... Yes, I did this. Wow. Um, the reason why it took... Or the reason why you have this space in the first place, in this area, is because I needed it for this. This is literally the only reason why all of that exists. <laughs> wow, this is this is complex. Yeah. You see, it I'm a kind of wraps around. I'm a basic redstone, redstone person. Yeah. Like I I know very little about redstone, and in my comments can 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 attest to that. Like, the most redstone I've used is to pull pistons down. That's it. I built a pretty mean automatic door, but, um... Yeah, no, this I is I followed this is a YouTube cool. video to get the sound, because this... This was a little intimidating to try and build up my own. Well, hey, bravo, though. This is, this is pretty cool. Okay, so how it works is... This, this chest right here will hold all of the gold nuggets or all the payment, so it's easy access. Um, but this chest over here is the trash chest. So let's say you try to use the, um, let's say you try to use it, but you don't have gold nuggets. Anything else you put in here, it will go into this trash chest and it will not activate the pokey, the healing sound, or and it will not give you a splash potion. Okay. Huh. All right, and then that, and so basically this activates all of this. Yes, 
So the minute that the item drops into this hopper right here, it activates this comparator, which powers this redstone right here, and it that redstone powers this repeater, which pushes the item into the chest at the bottom. Um, but it also powers this note block, which powers this note block, which then goes into like this whole snake of notes. And at the very end, oh, actually no, it powers this note block, sorry. Other way. It powers this note block, which goes all the way around, and it powers the final note. If I change the tempo right here, with these two, um repeaters it changes how fast you hear that last ding before you get splashed with a potion oh that's so cool you can change the tempo but if i change this tempo i have to change the one above it so that we it times correctly that it splashes you with the potion right when you hear this ding oh i got you okay that's pretty cool and then though you access this part from the back of the healing station so oh, the hello. Thing that's above ground is the two repeaters. See? The two repeaters that are set to the same time tempo as the last ding. Oh, I see what you mean. Yep. Okay. This chest is where I put all the potions and it feeds into these two dispensers, which then splash you with the potion. Smart! So like I said, I need to make some more potions. And okay. we're back. Um, so... Blue Jay has actually never seen the inside of my house before. Have after you? Me, I'm tiny. I'm Af tiny. After you. Thank you. It's very. Ow. It's, ve <laughs> it's very plain in here. But the thing I'm talking about is actually down here. I like this bird. Thank you. I wonder why. I like this bird. I wonder why. You, you can go over here with that one. Oh my god, how'd you get it to get on your shoulder? Did you 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 go up near it. No, you, 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 you have to train it. I will find you in the wild and you will be mine. <laughs> Where are we right. going? Down? Down. We're going down. We're going down. We're going down. This is not the system I'm talking about. Nice. This is the system I'm okay. talking about. Oh. Yeah, this is easy. I can do this. Yeah, like, I don't know why this took me so long. <laughs> like, at all. Wait, what? <laughs> Did you break it? I think you broke it. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm missing a piece of uh, redstone. But it's fine. I'm, it's not like I'm going to be using this anymore because it, because of my comments. Say, if the comments say they want me to move, then I'm moving. So, which I might end up moving. I might end up being mo moved anyway, so. But I think I'm just missing that. There you go. But yeah, I'm missing like okay. all of my bookshelves. I don't don't look at me. Like I said, I, this is the first time I've seen this. Yeah. Uh, By the yeah, way, I could I could do this. This this isn't and too difficult. I think you need this right here. This chest right here. <laughs> I think you need that just right there. So, guys, um, thank you guys very much for watching uh, the tour of the Pokeball. If you guys have enjoyed and you guys want to see more builds of uh, from Miss Blue Jay here, don't forget to hit that like button yeah. down below. And uh, if you guys want to become a part of my Survival Family today, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button, guys. Also, guys, if you want to get notified whenever I go live or upload a video, there's a little bell on the side of my subscribe button that you can hit to get notified whenever I do that. 
And guys, also with that, I'm Hopeful Survivor, and I will see y'all in that next video, guys. Peace.